Hey there, gearheads and petrol heads. Today we're going to be talking about the best sounding cars for each cylinder number. Whether you're revving up your engines or just admiring the sound of a roaring motor, we've got you covered. And before you ask, no, we're not going to include the sound of your uncle's beat up old pickup truck with a muffler held together by duct tape. One cylinder. The PLP50 is the ultimate pocket rocket, with its one-cylinder engine that sounds like a chainsaw on steroids. This microcar from the 1960s is about the size of a golf cart, but don't let its tiny frame fool you, it's got some serious attitude. When you fire up the engine of the P50, like you're starting up a mini tornado. This car is more powered than you'd expect and it's all packed into one little cylinder. It's like the David of the car world, taking on Goliath with its fierce engine sound. But it's not just the sound that makes the P50 special. This car is a true icon with a unique design that's sure to turn heads. It's like driving a cartoon character come to life with its bubble-shaped body and tiny wheels. You can't help but smile when you see it on the road. And let's not forget about the practicality of this microcar. It's perfect for city driving with its small size and maneuverability. You can zip in and out of traffic with ease, all while turning heads with that chainsaw-like engine sound. The P50 may be small, but it's mighty. Its one-cylinder engine is like a chainsaw on steroids, and it's guaranteed to make you smile every time you take it out for a spin. So if you're looking for a car that's both fun and practical, look no further than this iconic microcar from the 1960s. Two cylinders. Ah, the sweet sound of a two-cylinder engine, or is it? The Mazda R360 Coupe may look like a cute little go-kart with a roof, but don't be fooled. When you hear it rev up, it sounds like a swarm of angry bees. Seriously, it's like someone put a kazoo in a blender and hit the puree button. But hey, that's all part of the charm, right? Who needs a booming V8 when you can have the sound of a thousand buzzing insects? It's like a symphony of miniature engines all working together to create one unique yet unforgettable sound. So the next time you hear a Mazda R360 tube coming down the street, don't be alarmed. It's not a swarm of bees, it's just a tiny little car with a huge personality three cylinders. Ah, the sweet sound of a three-cylinder engine. And for this category, we're going with the Ford Fiesta ST. This little hot hatch has a loyal following amongst car enthusiasts, and it's for good reason. When you hear that engine rev up, it's like a tiny T-Rex letting out a roar. You half expect the car to grow a pair of little arms and start throwing punches. It's like the car is saying, hey, I may be small, but I'm fierce. And if you're lucky enough to hear a group of these bad boys revving in unison, it's like a tiny pack of dinosaurs preparing for battle. So the next time you see a Ford Fiesta ST on the road, be sure to give it a little respect. It may be small, but it's got a mighty roar. Four cylinders. Ah, the sweet sound of a four-cylinder engine. And for this category, we're going with a true classic, the Honda S2000. This little roadster has been winning hearts and minds for years, and it's not hard to see why. When you hear that VTEC engine kick in, it's like being transported to a heavenly realm. It's like a symphony of high-pitched screams, each one more melodious than the last. In fact, listening to the S2000 rev up is like attending a rock concert, with the engine as the lead singer and the exhaust as the drummer. It's music to our ears and we can't help but tap our feet along to the beat. So if you're in the market for a car that not only drives like a dream but sounds like one too, look no further than the Honda S2000. It's the perfect mix of power and performance with a soundtrack that will make you want to hit repeat. Five cylinders. Buckle up because we're delving into the world of five cylinder engines. Right, what did he say? Yes, you heard that right, five cylinders. It's an odd number, but that's what makes it so interesting. And for this category, we have the Audi RS3, a tiny sedan that packs a powerful punch. But what really stands out is its engine sound. It's like a bunch of angry squirrels got together to form a choir. You know, the kind of choir that's so intense it makes your ears bleed. Okay, maybe that's a bit dramatic, but you get the point. When you rev up the engine, it's like unleashing a group of tiny, furry creatures that are out for revenge. It's both terrifying and exhilarating at the same time. So if you're ever driving down the street and hear what sounds like a bunch of squirrels going to war, don't be alarmed, it's just an RS3. Six cylinders. 
Ah yes, the magical number 6, and for this category we're going with the legendary R34 Skyline GTR. It's a car that's been immortalized in movies and video games, and for good reason. When that straight 6 engine revs up, it's like a chorus of angels singing in perfect harmony. It's the perfect blend of power and precision, like a ballerina with a sledgehammer. 8 cylinders. Oh, we've reached the big leagues now with 8-cylinder engines, and for this category we've got a real monster in the form of the Dodge Demon. This car is so powerful it could probably lift a small building if it tried. And when that Hemi V8 engine starts revving up, it's like a sonic boom hitting you square in the chest. It's like the car is saying, hey, I'm here and I'm not messing around. If you're not careful, the demon might just scare the pants off you. But hey, that's the price you pay for riding on the wild side of automotive engineering. 10 cylinders. Ah, the 10 cylinder engines, where power and performance collide in a symphony of mechanical beauty. When it comes to this category, choosing just one car is like trying to pick a favourite child, it's nearly impossible. That's because we've got two heavy hitters vying for the top spot, the Lexus LFA and the Porsche Carrera GT. So let's take a closer look at these beasts and how their engines sound. First up is the LFA, a car that's been called a work of art on wheels. Its V10 engine is a masterpiece of engineering, producing a sound that's both powerful and harmonious. It's like the purr of a contented kitten, if that kitten had the lungs of a dragon. When you hear the LFA rev up, it's like the sound of a thousand tiny explosions happening in perfect unison. It's the kind of sound that makes you just want to close your eyes and listen, forgetting that you're in a car and not a concert hall. On the other side of the ring though is the Porsche Carrera GT, a car that's been hailed as one of the greatest sports cars of all time. And this is with good reason, its V10 engine is a work of art, producing a sound that's raw and animalistic. It's like a lion ready to pounce, with a throaty growl that makes your heart race faster than a cheetah chasing its prey. When you hear the Carrera GT rev up, it's like the sound of pure, unadulterated power. It's the kind of sound that makes you want to jump behind the wheel and just go, letting the car take you wherever it wants. So which one is the winner? Well, it's like trying to choose between cake or ice cream. You can't really go wrong with either one. The LFA's engine sound is like a symphony of mechanical perfection, while the Carrera GT's engine is like a wild animal that's just been let out of its cage. Either way, you're in for an adrenaline-filled ride that will make you feel like you're on top of the world. So buckle up, hold on tight, and let the engine do the talking. 12 cylinders. Oh boy, 12 cylinders, that's when you know you're playing in the big leagues, and for this category we're talking about the Pagani Huayra R. It's a car that's so rare it's like spawning a Sasquatch riding a unicorn, but when that V12 engine roars to life, it's like a choir of angels singing hallelujah in perfect harmony. It's the sound of pure extravagance, the kind of noise that would make a millionaire weep tears of joy, and if you ever get the chance to hear it in person, consider yourself blessed my friend. 16 cylinders. Ah, oh, the Bugatti Chiron and it's 16 cylinders. It's a monster of an engine that'll make your head spin. It's like the Hulk of cars, ready to smash anything in its path, and when you hear that quad turbo W16 engine rev up, It's like a thunderstorm that'll make even Thor jealous. It's the sound of pure, unadulterated power, and it's music to any car enthusiast's ears. But let's be honest, the Bugatti Chiron isn't just any car. It's a supercar, a hypercar, a car so exclusive that it's more likely to be seen in a museum than on the street. It's the kind of car that makes even Ferrari owners jealous and Lamborghini owners look twice. And when you're driving a Chiron, you're not just driving a car, you're driving a work of art. The Chiron isn't just about speed, although it has plenty of it. It's about luxury, it's about prestige, it's about having the best of the best. It's the kind of car that has a champagne cooler built into the center console and a diamond encrusted badge on the grille. It's the kind of car that makes you feel like a king or queen, even if you're just driving to the grocery store. But anyway, let's go back to the engine, and the Bugatti Chiron's W16 engine is like nothing else on the road. It's a marvel of engineering, a testament to human ingenuity. It's the kind of engine that could probably power or a small city if it weren't in a car. And when you hear that engine rev up, it's like the gates of hell have opened. It's the kind of sound that'll make your heart race and your palms sweat, even if you're just sitting in the passenger seat. But let's be real, if you're in a Chiron, you're probably not just sitting in the passenger seat. 
you're the one behind the wheel, gripping the steering wheel like your life depends on it. And maybe it does, because when you're driving a car with that much power, anything can happen. You could hit 60 miles per hour in less than two seconds. You could hit a top speed of over 300 miles per hour. You could become the envy of every car enthusiast on the planet. So yes, the Bugatti Chiron 16-cylinder engine is a thing of beauty, a thing of power, a thing of wonder. It's the kind of engine that will make you want to drive faster, harder, and longer than you ever have before. And if you're lucky enough to own one, you'll be the envy of every car enthusiast on the planet. Because let's face it, there is nothing like a Chiron, and there's nothing like a 16-cylinder engine. And there you have it, gearheads and petrolheads, the best sounding cars for each cylinder number. Whether you're a diehard gearhead or just appreciate the sound of a well-tuned engine, these cars are sure to make your heart race and your ears ring. So next time you're out on the road, keep an ear out for these beasts and maybe give them a little rev of your own. Thanks for tuning in to Gear Gossip's video on the best sounding cars for each cylinder number. If you did find this video informative and entertaining, please do consider subscribing to the channel and hitting the like button below. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when we post new videos and you'll be supporting us in creating more brilliant content like this. Don't forget to leave a comment below with your feedback and with ideas for future videos and we'll see you next time.